Hello everybody, happy Monday. Welcome to another weekly vlog. My name is Chelsea, I am 24 years old and I live in Darwin, Australia. I film weekly vlogs and fashion content, so if you're into any of that, please be sure to stick around, give this video a like and subscribe to my channel. It is a very chill Monday for me. I've been at the office all morning, but I have external meetings this afternoon, so I went and grabbed myself some lunch. I stopped and got GYG because I had a free burrito bowl. Um, from like my points that finally added up so that's exciting so I'm gonna have that I also got a coffee from the work cafe this morning that I'm still working on but I haven't eaten yet today so I thought it'd be a good idea for me to probably eat something because I was starting to feel a little bit not so good it was just a bit of a chaotic morning but that's pretty much all that's going on today I'm going to do my meetings I have those until nearly three o'clock so then I'm gonna go work from home for the last hour of the day on oh, I'm gonna sit and watch a YouTube video while I eat because that sounds like a nice way to spend my lunch break my next meeting not till one o'clock and it is 12 30 so I've got a little bit of time to like chill and have a lunch break which is nice and jazz hand has a new vlog so we're obviously gonna sit here and watch that it's a 45 minute vlog which I love I love her long vlogs but I don't have time to watch it all so I'll start watching it now and then we'll watch the rest of it a little bit later on today that's the game plan I hope you enjoy this video and let's get on with the rest of the week It is a lot later, it is 7.30 and I'm just getting ready for bed. I washed my hair tonight and I've just had it in my little microfiber towel for the last little bit. I'm gonna do some heatless curls, I'm gonna let it dry like a little bit more because it is still quite wet. I'm just chucking in some leave-in conditioner. This is the Way Spray leave-in conditioner. I love this stuff. And I honestly just put it all over and then just kind of scrunch it through. Sorry if you can hear that little bit of background noise. Jaden's just doing the dishes from dinner. We had carbonara, which was really, really good. We haven't had it in ages. We used to have it all the time. Um, but yeah, we had homemade carbonara, which was really nice. Um, and honestly, I think I'm going to put myself to bed. It's not even 8 o'clock yet, but I'm really, really tired. I'll probably like read for at least another half an hour or so so i won't be going to sleep just yet but i am gonna go tuck myself up into bed with maybe like a cup of tea oh a moon milk let's go make a moon milk i haven't had one in ages if you've seen my last like handful of weekly vlogs you know i've been house sitting for my parents so i haven't been in my space in my home for like quite a few weeks so it was nearly two months um so i'm really looking forward to just like getting back into routine this week into my own life and that includes moon milk so let's get one of those organized and then we'll read our book in bed and yeah it's gonna be a good week i've missed being at home that's for sure <music> Tuesday. Sorry for like not talking to the camera at all today. I had a crazy busy day. I started work at like basically 6.30 this morning and then when I finished I then went to my sort of second job sort of. I teach Pilates um, or I'm trained to become a Pilates teacher so on Tuesday nights I teach one session and then I train in one session. Um, so yeah, I had a class that I taught at 5.30 and then I participated in a Reformer Express class from 6.30 till 7.15. And Jaden made dinner for me while I was doing that, like an absolute legend. And now I pretty much just ate dinner. We chilled and watched TV for a little bit. Now I'm getting ready for bed. It is nine o'clock, so definitely my bedtime, especially because I had such an early start starting work at 6.30 this morning. Um, so I don't really have much to say about today. My class went really, really well. It was the first time that I got to teach completely independently um, with just like a supervisor, which was really cool. Um, and like definitely just like a fun sort of milestone, which was really, yeah, really great. Anyways, I can't do two things at once. So I'm going to do my skincare and go to bed and I'll catch up with you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Hello 
Hello guys, happy Thursday. I just went and picked up a parcel on my way home from work. I ordered from Revolve again, and I ordered, you can't get Steve Madden shoes in Australia, I don't think. So I ordered some from Revolve, and they're like the Hermes dupes for the Oran handles. I'm so excited. This box is so extra. Whoopsies. A box in a box, we love that. This is them from Steve Madden. I'm so excited. Oh, they're perfect. I love that. They look so good. Now, I wasn't sure about the sizing. I'm usually a seven, but I'm, I'm really often like an eight. Moment of truth, I, got, I could only get them in a 7.5. Okay, they fit. Perfect. That's so exciting. So yeah, I got the tan color. Um, and they've got like the stitching and everything like that. These are a really good dupe. They look really good. They didn't come in black, which is sort of what I wanted as well. I want a tan and a black pair, but they only had the tan. I don't know if that was just what was in stock or if like if that's it. I'm not sure. That is all that I got from the post office. We are going to have Guzman's for dinner. So we're going to head off in a minute, go on a little family outing to go get some tacos, which I'm so excited for. I'm so hungry. It is only quarter past five, but I'm already very much ready for dinner. So gonna get Wednesday ready to go and we're gonna go have some tacos say hello happy Thursday oh I'm dinky hello guys happy Thursday it is nearly lunchtime and I've finished work for the day because I'm doing a half day today mum and dad are getting back from Europe today so I'm picking them up from the airport around 3 30 but I just want to go and make sure the house their house is like really nice and immaculate as I mentioned earlier this week, we were house sitting for them. I moved back home over the weekend because I knew that would take up a lot of time. So now I'm going to go over and just like do like a final mop and unpack the dishwasher, do like wash sheets, things like that. Um, so we're going to do a little bit of a reset on a Thursday, which is crazy. You guys know my resets are usually on a Sunday, but that's okay. So we're going to find my headphones because I don't know where I put them. Bingo. So we're going to put on a podcast, going to put on our headphones, and we're going to do some cleaning. Let's go clean the house, and then I'm going to get ready to go pick them up because I've just been chilling at home. I'm just wearing my little dress from Princess Polly. I love this dress. It's so cute and comfy, but it did shrink in the wash, so it's kind of short. Um, so I can only really wear it as either like a beach cover-up or around the house because it is, yeah, kind of short. Okay, all the cleaning is done. I had to run to the post office, so that's why I got changed. Um, I just picked up something super exciting. So, Sports Girl messaged me on Instagram last week and they asked if they could send me something, which is so exciting. And it just arrived in the mail. This is the first ever time I've ever received PR, so I'm really, really excited. I thought we could open it on camera together to see what they sent me because all they asked was like what my dress size is and my shoe size. So, let's open it up. They wrote me a note. How exciting. Oh, how cute. It's a little matching set. Okay, so it's little brown linen-y shorts. How cute are they? And a matching top. It's a long sleeve. How cute. Oh my god, that's so exciting. Thank you so much, sports girl, for sending me my first ever PR. Well, I need to have a quick shower before I go and pick up my parents, and then I guess I should probably get changed into my new outfit, I'm thinking. Sounds like a plan. All right, I am running out of time though, so I'm gonna wrap this up, and I will chat with you guys when I'm back later today. Good morning, everybody. Happy Friday. I just filmed a little outfit of the day reel because it is a corporate free dress day on Fridays. We have to wear a uniform every other day of the week and we get to wear whatever we want on Fridays as long as it fits the corporate um, vibe of my office. So this is my outfit. I have had this top literally since I did work experience in year six. I think it's really cute. It's got little butterflies all over it. Um, it's from Taquito at Maya. I really doubt they still have it, but that's where it's from. My pants are Princess Polly. These are the Archer pants, and I love how versatile they are. And then I've just got my black stilettos from, these are from Novo. And then, of course, my Marc Jacobs tote bag to take with me to work. And then 
I just need to pack up a couple things, drop Wednesday at my parents' house because they are home. I didn't update you. They're home, we went to have family dinner last night, all that, it's great to have them home. Um, so I'm gonna go drop her off with the other dogs and my parents and then get a coffee on the way to the office and then last day of work before the weekend, which is so great. Happy Friday. It is quite a lot later. I had a really great day, work was fine, but then we came home, we went for a little bit of a swim, we went to the markets for dinner, which was a lot of fun. And now I'm gonna get ready for bed. I did a bit more makeup this morning than I usually do because I was a little bit more dressed up. I felt like I just wanted to put on a bit more makeup and just put a bit more effort into it, which means I have to put a little bit of extra effort into my skincare now. So, I thought I'd take you through my updated skincare routine. First of all, I got these little things from Amazon. They're literally like these little towel scrunchies so that water doesn't run down your arms when you wash your face. Then I take one of these reusable like makeup remover cloths and some micellar water. So I just use the Garnier Skin Active one and I remove all of my makeup using this and this is my first cleanse. Okay, and then when I feel like I've gotten off as much makeup as I can with that, I then cleanse my face which is just in the shower. This is the cleanser I've been using. It is the foaming cleanser from CeraVe. I've been trying a lot of like cheaper skincare recently. My entire routine is either Cetaphil, CeraVe or Garnier, um, which is all stuff you can get just from your local chemist instead or drugstore if you're um, American. So I just take my cleanser and I cleanse my face like, like normal. If I've had a lot of makeup on like today, sometimes I will do this twice. So the first micellar water is sort of more like a makeup remover and then I do a double cleanse. Otherwise, if I haven't worn as much or I've just done my normal makeup routine, um, I'll just finish it after this first cleanse and the micellar is like my first cleanse. Okay, and then that is all for my cleansing. So I take these off. And I've been using, I was breaking out a lot if you saw my last few vlogs, I've been using this blemish control gel. And honestly, I think it's been really working. All of these ones that were on my cheek are all flat. So I don't know if you can see that very well. I had a lot of breakouts on my cheek over here towards the end of last, or the start of last week. Um, so I just use a little bit of this gel which is for all over the face, but I just do like two little squeezes on each cheek or one squeeze on each cheek. And I just rub it in in circular motions. It has AHA and BHAs in it, which is how it works to clear up acne, I suppose. And then my last step is this Cetaphil moisturizing lotion. Um, this one's just really good. It's not too heavy, not too light. I don't get oily from it, which I do from a lot of moisturizers. I have quite oily skin, but I do still need to moisturize, so. And don't forget your neck and that's pretty much it for skincare i usually then like floss brush my teeth all that sort of thing and then if i'm feeling a little bit extra i'll do some facial oil and like a gua sha which i don't think i'm going to do tonight because i'm not really in the mood i kind of just want to get to bed um and then i do my hair care too so i'll brush out this gel because i don't ha have time to wash it tonight and I have pilates in the morning so i might as well just let it let it go for now so yeah, that is all for tonight. I will catch up with you guys tomorrow. I think I'm gonna watch a movie in bed for tonight um, and just like chill and yeah, just have some quiet time. <laughs>Happy Saturday. I just had Pilates feeling fantastic. It was a really good session. Um, my instructor mixed it up a little bit and she did like a bar reformer combo sort of thing and it was really really good I really enjoyed it um, so I'm just pulled up to the cafe I'm just waiting for my friend to pull up as well and we're gonna go get some brunch uh, it's nearly 10 o'clock and I am so ready for a coffee I actually had pre-workout this morning I had a um, an oxy shred with stim usually I have the non-stim because I work out in the afternoons but I had the stimulant one today and I mixed it with my greens as usual and I drank that on the way I didn't actually finish all of it but I'm not gonna finish it now but yeah that's all I've had today so I'm ready for a coffee and something to eat and I'll catch up with you guys a bit later mm -hmm. 
Hello guys, it is much later and I am looking very oily. I put in a hair mask um, and I like oiled my scalp, which I haven't done in ages and it's kind of overdue. So it's been feeling super dry in the last week or so. So I thought I would oil it and see how that goes. I'm also gonna give it a scrub and everything, but I'm gonna do a quick little juice shot. I showed this one earlier this week. It's the immunity shot. Um, honestly, I don't really know if this is what I need. Like my digestion's feeling really not good today, but it does have ginger in it, which is really good for digestion. And then turmeric is good for inflama inflammation. <laughs> um, so hopefully this will help a bit. Okay, juice shot. Cheers. That was a bit aggressive, sorry about that. It's the shape of the glass. It makes it harder to shot back, but this is the smallest glass that I own, so. Mm. Okay. Hopefully that makes my tummy feel a little bit better. And then while I was standing here literally just then, I realized they have peppermint slash spearmint tea. So I might make a glass of that to see how that goes and just to sip on. I don't think I've had quite enough water today. Um, I've had like one and a half liters, but it's four o'clock. So probably not enough at this point in time. So, and then we're having dinner at my family's place tonight. We're having a Sunday roast, even though it's Saturday, um, because we all have plans for tomorrow evening. So that's the game plan for the rest of the night. Hello guys, happy Sunday. I have had a fun morning. Um, one of my friends, first of my friends to have a baby and it was her first birthday today. So I was at that all morning. It's the first kids party I've been to like as an adult. Like I said, she's my first friend to have had a baby. So it was kind of weird. Like I didn't really know what to do. You're just kind of like there for the baby who has no idea what's going on. But it was really good and it was a lot of fun. I went afterwards to the shopping center. I picked up some coffees and I did just bring one to Jaden and he's just gone back to work. I brought it to him in his lunch break. And I also got a gluten-free Nutella donut because everyone had birthday cake and I couldn't have birthday cake because it had gluten in it. So that's pretty much all that's happened. I am now gonna go do a bit of a grocery shop haul situation because we have like no food and obviously week starts tomorrow and I want to be a bit more organized with my food this week. That's pretty much the update of the day. I am going to go and hopefully my video has uploaded my weekly vlog from like three weeks ago. I'm still waiting for that to upload. I'm that behind on my videos and I'm getting really frustrated because it's not like all the videos are edited. I just can't get anything freaking uploaded because the internet is like useless, you know? Anyways, I'm going to get going. I'll catch up with you guys a little bit later this afternoon. Okay, quick grocery haul. I stocked up on a few things for work. So I've just got some noodle cups for my desk drawer for when I forget my lunch. Also some fruit bread for when I forget my breakfast. And then some honey cashew nuts just for snacking on, which I love having snacks in my office desk in case I forget to bring anything. Then for fruit, I got strawberries and bananas. I got Wednesday another puppy loaf. I got this mango and coconut chia pudding mix, which sounds really, really interesting. I'm looking forward to giving that a go at some point this week. Um, a few more cold brew coffees because they're still on sale um, and then for dinner we're having protein pasta so I got some mincemeat the red lentil pasta some carrots spinach and some cheese all to go in that and then also some bolognese like pasta jar sauce um, I got us some more milk because we're completely out so I stocked us up a little bit same for coffee pods they were on sale so I stocked up on a few different flavors and then just some hand soap because again we ran out um that's everything. I haven't been doing huge, huge grocery hauls. Like I've just been buying one dinner at a time because in this weather, food just keeps going bad so quickly. So I only got a little bit of fruit and a little bit of veggies and that's the grocery haul. getting ready for bed. Um, I checked off pretty much everything on my to-do list this afternoon. I did not edit the weekly vlog. 
um, or not all of it at least, and that was the only thing on the list that I didn't actually get done, so I'm pretty happy with that. Just wrapping up for the night, which means for the vlog, it is Sunday night, which means we'll be starting a new vlog tomorrow. Wow, this is really a look, isn't it? Anyway, I'll be starting a new vlog tomorrow at the start of a new week. So that is all for today. Um, I really do hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure you do give it a like and subscribe to my channel. I do weekly vlogs every single week and fashion videos every single week as well. So if you're into any of that, make sure you do stick around. As you have heard me mention in this vlog a couple of times now, I'm having internet issues at the moment. So hopefully I'll get a fair bit of content up for you guys this week and just like sort of upload the backlog so there might be like four videos this week if I can get the internet to work which I'm really hoping I can. I still haven't been able to push through that first weekly vlog. Um, it's on like 18% now so hopefully some point through the night it'll push through I really hope because I'm getting super frustrated with the IT issues. But that's all for today. I hope you have a great day or night wherever you are and I will see you in a future video. Bye!